Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Overall, uh, a decent day. A lot of clouds, but also some filtered sunshine as well. And for the most part, staying dry, no showers. We'll keep an eye to the sky next couple of hours for maybe a pop-up shower. But even that chance is pretty small. So your Friday evening looks quiet, heading out not too bad. Very warm, too hot this weekend. In fact, uh, we're talking about uh, another heat wave on the way now. We have sunny skies this weekend. It does turn hotter on Sunday, uh, topping out at 92. Uh, the beaches look good, but another heat wave. You need three consecutive days of 90 or higher, and we should meet that criteria Sunday, Monday into Tuesday with uh, Monday actually being uh, the hottest day. How hot? Well, here's the deal. Now, we may not hit 90 on Saturday, but it is very warm to hot at 88. Low 90s on Sunday, 95 on uh, Monday. Feel like temperatures, heat index running over 100 degrees with the humidity, and that extends into Tuesday as well with a high temperature at about 92. Satellite photos showing the clouds streaming overhead right now, but dry clouds, no precipitation. Steady rain is well offshore. You see the clearing off to our west, and that'll be working in later on this evening and during the overnight, and this sets up for plenty of sunshine this weekend. Tropics getting active. As we get into the middle and eventually the end of summer, things really start to ramp up. This is a tropical storm, uh, Gonzalo. Uh, good news with this, though. It, it's really poorly organized. The winds are only 45. Here's the Caribbean, Puerto Rico, right in here. This will track into the Caribbean over the next several days as a tropical storm, then eventually weakening to a tropical depression. So good news. But of more concern to the continental U.S. is in the Gulf of Mexico. This is newly formed tropical storm Hannah with winds of 50 miles per hour much better organized on the satellite photo here is Texas and Corpus Christi anticipated to become a minimal hurricane over the next 24 hours making landfall tomorrow as a hurricane near Corpus Christi hurricane warnings in effect for South uh, Texas we'll keep you posted in the meantime we'll take you closer to home we got a sunny, hot weekend on the way. Here's the deal. This evening and overnight, clouds are decreasing with temperatures in the 70s. Here we are tomorrow morning at 6 a.m., starting off at around 66 with sunshine and then warming up to the mid and upper 80s. It's very warm to hot, and you can see the temperatures here inland, mid to upper 80s, coastline around 80. Great beach day, plenty of sun, certainly more sunshine than what we had uh, today. I was actually down in Narragansett this morning working on a story, and even though it was kind of cloudy at Narragansett Town Beach, there were still people on the beach enjoying the dry weather anyhow. But more sunshine at the beaches tomorrow. Uh, 6 o'clock tomorrow evening, we're looking at sunshine, very warm temps, well into the 80s, and your Saturday night is warm and humid with temps in the 70s at 11 o'clock. So for tomorrow morning, sunshine. By 11 a.m., it's up to 84 in upper 80s tomorrow afternoon, so very warm and humid with uh, a good deal of sunshine. And, and the beach is not bad either. All right, seven day forecast uh, 92 on Sunday, 95 on Monday. A couple of our computers are actually forecasting 100. Real hot, more than likely a heat advisory kind of a thing coming up on Monday. Tuesday, 92 with a late day thunderstorm, and then temperatures get back to more seasonable levels by the middle of the end of next week with daytime highs at around uh, 85. Shannon?